If you haven't guessed it by now, the VNX is an intelligent storage system. Now, what makes it intelligence? What do you think? You know, I think it's software. Software makes everything intelligent, right? But there's also some other components that are, that are key elements in understanding what an what a intelligent storage system really provides. That's things like the back end. That's your connectivity between your SPs and your disks themselves. That is considered the quote-unquote back end. That is that SAS bus interconnect between those two. Uh, your front end is really what your what your hosts are connecting to over your over your network, either over your you know your IP network, your Ethernet network, or a fiber channel network. And those front end ports can consist of fiber channel ports. You know, eight gig uh, is is common nowadays. Could be uh, copper. You know, Ethernet ports. You've got a couple different options, even ten gig, and they're all coming in across those front end ports because they talk data center protocols such as fiber channel, FCOE, and then they're hitting cache directly, which is really the next component of this. So data that is written to the front end usually hits cache first, and then an acknowledgement is sent back to the host itself. Uh, the, another major component of the intelligent storage system is the disk, the back-end disk. So all four of these together with software kind of automating and steering and managing all of this is what makes up an intelligent storage system.